Yeah, well, last year they had breakout sessions where you got to choose what you wanted to learn. Well, this year everyone will stay in the same room right here in the Smith Pendergraph Campus Center behind me to hear from a panel who will take the stage. Now, this is video here from last year's breakfast. You will get your meal this year and hear from a panel speaking about local and national issues affecting our community. The event is called A Letter, a Fort Smith Community Forum. Now, some of the speakers on the panel include Steve Clark, the founder of ProPack Logistics, Georgia Hale, the provost for the university, Representative George. George McGill and Charlotte Tidwell, the founder of the Antioch Consolidated Association for Youth and Family. Now, it is the fifth year that the campus has hosted the event, and the legacy left behind by Dr. King was something that Paul Barron, the chancellor of the university, says he thought was important for this institution to remember. When I came here 10 years ago, uh, we were not uh, celebrating Martin Luther King Day as a holiday, and we changed that. And so we, now we celebrate, you know, there's no classes, there's no. And of course, you know, the students don't have the classes and they also can come to this community event this morning and you can as well. It starts at 8 o'clock this morning. It's no pre-registration necessary. It is all free for the breakfast and also the panel discussion. Live in Fort Smith, Pedro Rivera, 4029 News. All right, Pedro. And following the breakfast and panel discussion, there will be a march through the center of campus. You're, of course, welcome to join.